if you're lucky. If you're really blessed. You will get to fall in love three times in this lifetime. You'll have a soulmate relationship, connection. There is karmic connection. And then the trendy one, the most sought after at the moment, the twin flame connection. And they don't follow that order for everybody. But they're the, tr the three most potent, passionate, in love experiences that some people get to enjoy. Even the karmic connection, even the karmic relationship, it's not fun when it's unraveling and when it's ending but looking back on it you will feel grateful appreciation even for having met that person because their soul was meant to come along to push you to ignite the true essence of who you are to blossom and that's that's why you had that experience that's why they showed up the soulmate experience can be here to teach you about magic about sparkling in each other's eyes it's it's all the cliches of how love songs and films and books are inspired and created it's often from the soulmate experience it can often be the one that lingers in your heart that is like a fresh true love first love experience but again it all depends on where along your timeline that you and your soulmate agree to meet so for some people, it will be early, early on. It's often the case. First love. For others, it can be much later. Like I know, I know actually two people who met their soulmate in their 60s. Had totally given up on love. And in walks their soulmate and they knew immediately. That was the one. The twin flame experience is much more unusual. It's, it is increasing and I've done podcasts about this. I've talked about how in the last year or two, there is more and more soulmates coming together and connecting and uniting. So some of you will be in that bracket, especially in the next four years. You will be crossing paths with your, or sorry, with your twin flame. Did I say soulmate? I meant twin flame. So the twin flame experience is cosmic, out of this world. Talk about magic, talk about fireworks, but from a very spiritual and earthly perspective, it's like a synergy of the cosmos and earth coming together and creating that union and the whole reason soulmates come together in a lifetime is so that they will join together in service to humanity join together to be of service when their powers when their souls come together it creates this incredible vortex of energy it opens a portal and whether children come through there or whether they become healers together or shamans or teachers or they travel the world and help people in need. There is this 
powerful sense of being together on a soul mission. And that's what that union is about. So if you'd like me to discuss more about these topics, you can give this video a like, you can subscribe, and I'll chat to you soon. Bye bye.